great. Um, a few bumps and bruises, but uh, other than that, you know, I won, so I'm happy. Same thing in the first. Uh, I would have done it in the first had Jack not been full of energy and spry and ready to kick my ass myself. But, um, you know, after those first couple of takedowns and a few strikes landed, I uh, kind of took the steam out of his sails a little bit, slowed down a little bit. He expended a lot of energy trying to get those takedowns. And, um, it, you know, he paid for it in that second round. You know, he came out a little bit slow. He, tr he tries to come out fast in the second round. And uh, he came out slower than I expected. Um, and he start, was giving me ground, so I started taking it. And then that, uh, that momentum started shifting big time. And I just took complete advantage of it. He tried to shoot on me, and I hit him with the uppercut. That's what happened. And then he, uh, he went down. So I dropped him with that uppercut. He went down, and I was on his ass. So, uh, you know, I think I just took the mantle of uh, best ground and pound in the world because I just finished the best ground and pounder in the world with ground and pound. It doesn't matter where I am in the division. I'm just here. Um, people better take notice because if they don't, then they're going to uh, not be ready when they face me. It doesn't matter what's next as long as, you know, we got a saying in the gym. And I have a saying myself. It doesn't matter who it is. But the saying in the gym is we just got to win the next fight. So um, back to the drawing board. Uh, learn from the mistakes we made tonight and uh, get better. Professional curiosity has me, uh, gonna, is going to have me glued to the screen on that one. I'm also a huge fan of both of those fighters. Um, Israel, uh, Israel, especially, I'm a huge fan of his. I've been a fan of his before he got into the UFC. Um, but it's going to be a good fight. Both are great fights. Uh, Whitaker has done great things. I think beating uh, Romero twice is, is huge, you know. Um, so uh, I'm, I'm not going to, I don't pick fights, you know. I can give you an analysis, but uh, I don't pick fights. Those are two great fighters, and hopefully they both come out and uh, put on a show for everybody. Well, uh, uh, Jack kicked me in the rib, and I feel he displaced the rib, so I'll probably be on the shelf for like two or three weeks, but I uh, will definitely stay in shape. Um, but, you know, whatever's next is what's next. It doesn't matter to me.